Well, what we're doing now is taking out a screw that we previously inserted for a bunion. So with my thumb, I palpate the head of the screw and stick a small needle down the center of the screw because it's cannulated or hollow. And we'll take this 64 beaver blade. It's a very tiny blade, it's probably three millimeters. We make a little poke in the skin and go straight down to the head of the screw. And then we simultaneously will place this guide pin down the center of the screw and then remove the needle and the pin falls right back into its place. We'll then take this hollow screwdriver, as you see it has a little hole at the tip, it goes straight down the center of the guide pin, right to the head of the screw. We will engage the screw, rotate it counterclockwise, and the screw will emerge through the skin, as you see right there. And we'll slowly back it out. And then, once the screw's out, we'll just grab it with our hand, and slowly wiggle it out of the foot. We will then actually irrigate it. And then, all you need to do is put one small stitch over that incision and we'll bandage it up. The following day, by the way, the patient will be able to remove the bandage and place a band-aid over that spot and get back to wearing any shoes that they wish. The patient's foot was previously numbed. They are sedated right now, and they will be awake in a matter of two minutes. You can see that procedure only took about five minutes to do. And there you have it. It's complete.